It's very difficult for me to comprehend, and it's just something of I struggle with um, every day. It's just unfair. Confused and heartbroken, this family wants to know why someone randomly attacked and killed a 74-year-old grandfather in broad daylight. Such a devastating story. Brittany Thomas and Learn Police are still investigating a motive. Phoenix police say Juanito Falcon was walking near 17th Avenue and Bethany Home Road when a man attacked him for no apparent reason. His family says they want justice. I'm deeply sad. Um, I'm scared and I'm devastated. Of course, I, I feel angry. For an uncle, Jacqueline Lozada describes as kind and charismatic. She can't imagine why anyone would attack him. You took a very special person away from us and he had so many more years to give and so much more love. Court records say Marcus Williams punched Juan Nito Falcon until he fell to the ground, striking his head on the pavement. The 74-year-old died two days later and police arrested Williams for second degree murder. Although investigators say they don't have any evidence the victim was targeted for his race, Falcon's niece, Lysander Lanuza, believes otherwise. Being Asian uh, that he is, that I, I believe that he specifically was targeted. With so many mysteries surrounding Falcon's death, family keeps their focus on the loving legacy he left behind. We always felt loved by him and we always felt safe and he always made us smile. They say the only thing that's getting them through this time is prayers. That's why they're asking for your prayers and they have a GoFundMe page you can find on the AZ Family app. Brittany Thomason, Arizona's Family.